Welcome to the Wild and Scenic Film Festival HQ Ticketing and Support Team training. As a member of the HQ Ticketing and Support Team, you help create the magic of the Wild and Scenic Film Festival where nature's beauty takes center stage and inspires change. HQ Ticketing and Support 101. During the festival, volunteers are stationed at the headquarters in Grass Valley, Center for the Arts, and Nevada City, Seven Stars Gallery. In the following slides, we'll show you detailed instructions on how to support patrons, handle ticket purchasing, session reservations, and troubleshoot common issues. Start of shift checklist. Upon arrival at the venue, check in with your HQ lead by telling them your name and the role you signed up for. Once you're checked in, they'll hand you your volunteer badge. This is to be returned before you end your shift. Your HQ lead will direct you to a tablet or laptop preloaded with the box office website Eventive on the device. Please verify it's logged in and ready. For more information about Eventive, see instructions later in the video. Verify that the printer is linked via Bluetooth or wire to the laptop. You'll also be oriented on the pass distribution system and shown which pass type is where. For instance, sponsor passes are in this box while filmmaker passes are in this box. Before we dive into the nitty gritty of HQ ticketing and support instructions, let's take a look at the types of passes that you'll encounter and how you can support festival patrons through a pass or ticket purchase. Here you can take a quick look at our 2024 fest passes. These are all of the badges that you'll encounter while you're sorting passes and handing them to patrons, and you may also help with purchases of those passes. You can also see that you can purchase single session tickets to the festival. Now, let's learn how to place orders in the Eventive box office. The first thing you'll want to do is to log in at admin.eventive.org and enter your credentials. You'll log in and then you're going to go over to the left hand menu and select 2024 Wild and Scenic Film Festival. And then you're going to select box office from under that. And that will bring you to the box office page where you can create orders for individual tickets for film sessions, passes, as well as membership and other add-ons. You can also add discounts to your order. So for the first example, I'm going to show you how to uh, make an order for a pass. So we're going to select the pass. We're going to select the Yuba pass. And then we are going to, if you wanted to add a discount to that, you would select the circle member discount. As you can see, that reduced the price by $10. You're going to scroll down, enter the information that you'd like on your pass. As you can see, that changed the name on the pass. This is a box office order. And we're going to enter an email address here. And then we're going to choose a payment method. You can choose check or cash if they're in office or in person, or a card as well. And we will enter the card number. So we'll choose the card here. And once you choose the card information, it will come up with the blue button to go ahead and place that order. And then you'll click on that and that will complete the order. Now, another option for the box office would be that someone wants an individual ticket to an event. If you're gonna do that, you're gonna select the individual event. In this case, there's a dinner and a movie special event for general admission or a dinner and a movie option for if you are a pass holder. Um, for the pass holder option, you can see watershed reservation. I'm gonna select that. And then I will need to enter the information about what pass that is. So I selected my watershed pass. That makes it zero. We'll choose the information here. And then there'll be no need for a card to be entered because this is using the pass. And so you just click on place order and that will apply that ticket to whichever customer's pass you have selected. Now, if they're buying a pass and they are also adding a membership, you're going to select item, membership, 
you know, select the level of membership that they would like. Then you also add on that circle member discount. Since they're getting a membership, you'll see that drops down the pass price here from 150 to 140. And then you'll go through that same process where you're going to enter the name and information for that pass. then choosing the payment method and then clicking on place order to complete that. When you complete an order that will email the customer and send them information about redeeming their pass, picking up their pass at HQ and other important information. Lastly, if you're just doing a single ticket for a general admission ticket, box office order in this case. So it's a box office order in this case for the dinner and a movie. Same exact process where we're going to enter the email of the customer, enter their address and phone number, and then select the option for payment, and then click place order to complete that order. And that should cover the main ways in which you can create purchases for customers in the box office in the back end of Eventive. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to reach out to Eric Dunn with, for more information. Thanks. Now, let's learn how to place a session reservation with an existing pass in the Eventive box office. If you want to double check that you have a pass, you can go up here to the upper right corner, click on My Passes, and here you see I have a festival pass. I've not used it for any reservations yet. And so if we go back to the main menu, then we can go over to the schedule and we can go and select the session that we might be interested in. And so I'm interested in attending the late night movies. And so once this screen comes up, you're going to click on the purple order tickets button. And that will come up with the option to order that ticket uh, through your pass. Uh, there's also an option to buy additional tickets. If you've already ordered that with your pass, you can only order one ticket per session with your pass. Um, and so if you want multiples, you can buy an additional single tickets. In this case, I'm going to cl click on the quick order one ticket with the pass. Click that. This screen comes out for checkout. As you can see, I'm currently logged in. And because of that, the price for this order is $0. So we're going to click buy. And now we've got the ticket confirmation that we have those tickets. Now, if I want to see which tickets I have and go to my tickets, which also lives in the upper right hand corner as well, my tickets. And you can see here that late night movies is right there. And if for some reason I, I didn't have uh, my pass with me, which you should, but if some reason you didn't, uh, you can show the barcode and that'll come up and you can gain entry to the session using that barcode. Um, you can also see there's some other options that come up there. In this case, I'm going to go ahead and cancel that ticket because I will not be attending that. And now I don't have any tickets. I can go back to the browse schedule and choose a session that I would like. For more detailed instructions, on how to sell passes, tickets, make reservations, and troubleshoot common questions, please see the printed step-by-step -step guide in your HQ handbook. Now, let's jump into the HQ ticketing and support team welcome and other key information to keep in mind during your shift. Welcome the attendees warmly and be sure they go to the correct table, sponsor, filmmaker, purchaser, etc. to pick up their passes. If you're helping an attendee with an existing pass, ask them for their full name and find their pass in the box of plastic of passes in the plastic holders. The following stickers on passes correspond to items they should receive at check-in. Purple star equals purple wristband for Saturday night filmmaker party. Blue star equals VIP bag. In theory, these folks will be national partners, filmmakers, circle staff and board, festival committee, programming committee, special guests, and a few other eligible sponsors. Distribute swag bags, full-color Chico bag with goodies inside, to the following pass holders. Watershed pass holders, filmmaker pass holders, national partner sponsors, listed here, as well as film jury pass holders. During your shift, 
you'll be supporting Circle and Wild and Scenic staff members. There might be times where things are slow, potentially during session times, and there might be times when we experience a rush. Hard to predict the timing here, so we always do our best to stay prepared. If you're waiting for a task or a patron to support, thanks for keeping in mind that headquarters leads will let you know if there's anything else that you can do to help. Just your presence is helpful, and sometimes you may be able to read a book, look at your phone, etc. if there are no other tasks. During your shift, your headquarters leads will be a resource throughout your festival shift. Some staff will be more focused on filmmakers and sponsors, others VIP donors, others patrons, others volunteers, but we're all there to support. If there's a question you don't know the answer to, ask a headquarters lead and they'll help. As a member of the HQ Ticketing and Support team, you help us provide excellent service to our festival patrons. Thank you. End of shift checklist. Check the battery status of devices, place them on chargers as needed. If you're working the final shift of the day, return the device to your HQ lead. Leave equipment and surfaces clean and orderly and ready for the next shift to take over. No garbage laying around, wipe up counters and other surfaces, etc. Check out your volunteer shift by returning your volunteer badge to your HQ lead. In return, they'll hand you your comp ticket code, which can be used to reserve a seat at an upcoming film session online. You have now completed the pre-festival HQ ticketing and support team training for the Wild and Scenic Film Festival. Thanks for joining us and helping create the magic of the fest this year. If you have any questions that should be addressed pre-festival, feel free to call the Circle office. Any other questions will be addressed by your venue captain or HQ lead upon arrival. We can't wait to see you soon. Thank you.